So in the previous video, we did an analysis where we looked at what countries do our most popular beer stem from. But of course, if we're talking about geographical data like countries, maybe we could plot that on a map. And in our worksheet, we also have information about latitude and longitude. So wouldn't it be cool if we would have a map of the world that would show exactly where the breweries are, where our most popular beers come from? Maybe we can plan a field trip to the closest, most popular brewery. So luckily, there's a super cool thing in Excel 2013 that's called Power Map. And we're going to use that to do exactly that. Plot our beers on a map. So we you just click Power Map once you have, have installed this plugin. And then you get a map right there. And all the data from our data model from Power Pivot is right there. So what we can do is drag, one, drag just the breweries on. And you get little dots for all of the breweries. But this is based on the entire list of breweries, on the one worksheet, not yet on the connected list connected to what we are selling. In order for us to do that, we need to drag the quantity in, very similar to how we would do it in a normal pivot table. And what we get then is all the breweries with the quantity that we are selling in our bar. So we can see that this brewery right here, this is the La Trappe Brewery, is kind of close to where our bar is. Uh, let's assume our bar is in Delft, where this university is too. So we have a pretty popular brewery that's right close to Delft. That would be nice for a field tip. So what I've done now is I've also added the time dimension. And you get a little animation where you can see during the time, during the opening hours of our bar, you see the beers basically being drunk by the people in the bar. And you can play that time as an animation. And what we can furthermore do is add a category. So you see what type of beers stem from what brewery. So you see here, let me remove that. You see that blue is a certain type of beer and orange is another type of beer. And you see it right on your map. No formulas needed, you just drag your data in, you say, this is the, these are the breweries, the quantities and the categories, and you get your visualization right on the map. So let's have a look at the rest of the world. We don't need to concentrate on Europe. If you look at the US, we see another interesting visualization. We see that here's a brewery of which two of the beers that are being sold are really popular. And here's an area in the US where a lot of breweries are popular. So maybe if we want to have a field trip very far away, this would be an interesting area of the US to actually go to. And again, I can't stress this enough. We didn't use any formulas. If we just load all our data into the Power Pivot data model, we can then use Power Map, if it's geographical data, to plot everything on a map just by the selecting the fields that we want to use. And that closes the entire week to show you the power of pivot tables, little use of formulas. You can just analyze your data by clicking and dragging. Isn't that nice? See you next week.